guys, it's Alyssa. I am back. I know. It's been such a long time since I've filmed a video for you guys, and I'm really, really, really sorry about that. Um, I just have been really busy with school and other activities that it's been really hard to, like, sit down and film a video for you guys and get one planned out and then edit it, and especially since I don't have Wi-Fi at my house, it's just really hard to do all that. So I hope you guys understand, and hopefully I'll be uploading a lot more videos from now on. But there might be a couple times where I miss a week or two, and I'm really sorry about that in advance. Anyways, like today, we have a new video. Today's video is a what's on my iPhone video. I love watching these videos, and I thought it'd be super fun to make one of these videos because I love them so much. So yeah, that is what I'm going to do today. Just to let you guys know, I am not trying to brag at all. I'm not, I'm not into that kind of thing. So yeah, I'm not trying to brag at all. Without further ado, let's just get into the video. Okay, so this is my iPhone, and by the way, the light changed because I'm filming this part a different day. But yeah, so this is my iPhone, and I have the iPhone 6S in rose gold, 32 gigabytes, and yeah. So I've had it for about a month, and then I got my phone case, which is a spec case, and I got it from Amazon. So my lock screen here... Let's see if it's going to, like, focus and not be so bright for the whole video. Yeah. Okay, so my lock screen is basically just these, like, lines. And they just, like, there's mountains in the back, and it's really, really, really pretty. So, yeah. And then my background for this part is just this marble background, which I found on Pinterest. I found both of my background, my lock screen and my home screen on Pinterest. So, yeah. And if you guys are wondering, I will post... A tweet of my lock screen and my and my home screen on Twitter once this video is up so you guys can go find them if you like okay so if you can't tell I've deleted a bunch of apps that were really useless off my phone like um, because of the iOS 10 update you can delete apps that you don't need anymore so I did that I did that for a bunch of my apps and yeah let's just get started so the first apps are basically the basic ones that we all have but I'm gonna say them anyways so I have mail, calendar, photos, then I have a camera, clock, weather, notes, reminders, iTunes store, app store, settings, contacts, safari, calculator, FaceTime, music, and then I have Twitter. And if you guys are wondering, my Twitter is Alyssa underscore N with two E's. I said Anne really weirdly. But yeah, you guys should go follow me on Twitter because I post a lot of really random stuff. And then this bottom row down here, you guys can't see, I have phone, Snapchat, my Snapchat is private, Instagram, and my Instagram is Alyssa underscore and with four E's, yeah. And then I have messages, and then on this page, sorry if I have to like keep zoom zooming in, I just want you guys to be able to see, I have a folder called extras, and in that folder I just have compass voice memos, find iPhone, wallet, health, videos, and maps, and these are some of the apps that I want to delete, but I just can't because, well, I might use them one day, and because some of them I couldn't, it just wouldn't allow me to. And then my next folder is photography, and I just have ViscoCam, which is basically how I edit my Instagram photos. If you guys want to see a how I edit my Instagram photos, comment down below. And then I have Pic Collage which is kind of self-explanatory. It's basically where you can do collages and stuff for your photos. And then I have a folder called School Crap. And in that, I just have Power School, which is this thing that my school uses to, like, check our grades. Then Schoology, which is another thing my school uses. And, like, we get updates from my teacher on our different classes and stuff. And then I have Quizlet, where you can, like, make flashcards and stuff. And, yeah. It's really helpful. And you can make quizzes and just quiz yourself for tests. And stuff then I have health and in here I don't use this app but I just have Swerk it it's like a workout app I don't really use it but yeah then in music I have Spotify and then Amazon music and on Spotify um, I don't really use it so I don't have a ton of playlists and stuff and it's not even gonna load so yeah and then Amazon music just has music and then in my next folder I have YouTube and I just have the YouTube app um, YouTube Creator Studios which allows you to look at your like um, 
comments and stuff, it's a lot easier. And then I have iMovie, which you all know what that is. And then in my next folder, which is called shopping, I have Amazon, Unsplurge, and Unsplurge you can like make goals and it helps you save up for them. So like, I don't know, it just helps you save up for whatever you want to save up for. And then I have Forever 21, which you all know what that is. I just like to look and stuff. And then in Stupid Games, I have Bitmoji, which isn't really a game. I just have it there. But it's this, um, if you don't know what Bitmoji is, Snapchat. It's like um, related to Snapchat. And you can make, like, I don't know how to explain it. But basically, you make your character on Snapchat. <laughs> then I have Wells Fargo, which I'm not going to show you guys because that's weird because that's my bank account thing. Then I have um, the Holy Bible, which you guys probably have a decent idea what that is and then I have musically and yeah I do have musically it's really 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 bad so don't follow me um no I'm kidding you can go follow me if it's gonna load goodness my musically is Alyssa and with four e's which you guys should go follow me in there and then in food games I just have restaurant story and bakery story and basically you just make your own restaurant and it's really 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 fun and addicting game. And then the last app that I have down here is called Uvu and it's basically like FaceTime, like the Apple FaceTime, but you can have more than one person like FaceTiming you and so there can be like three people FaceTiming each other so I just use that when I want to FaceTime some of my friends. Okay, so that was today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah. Make sure to comment down below like apps that I should get because I don't have like anything on my phone as you just saw. So make sure you guys comment down, comment below apps that I should get that are cool and stuff. Um, make sure you subscribe and like this video and yeah. And make sure to follow me on all my social media which will be like somewhere on the screen or down in the description box. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!